Tuzman here, and uh, this might be the hardest, one of the hardest videos I've ever had to make. Um, uh, as we know, uh, first of all, beginning of the the, the video uh, disclaimer: if you are sensitive to gambling topics, you might want to skip this one. Uh, it's okay. It, it's fine. Uh, just a big disclaimer: if you're sensitive to gambling topics, it might be you know move on to you know me talking about losing the games or talking football, which will be throughout the week. Um, unfortunately, uh, I didn't really know what happened yesterday, um, and because uh, uh, I, I was busy, I'm always busy on Monday. Monday is my, my most busiest day. Um, but, uh, we lost Pete Rose last, uh, yesterday, um, uh, and, uh, the reason why I make this video is, as an Ohioan, as a baseball fan, um, let's, let's face it, let, let's take all the gambling stuff out. Pete Rose was one of the, the greatest baseball players of all time. One of the greatest. And this video is about, you know, should he be in the Hall of Fame? Um, and, uh, and, and, and we're going to talk about some, some gambling issues here. Cause, um, let's just face it. Nowadays you get on your phone, you download the app, you make two taps and about you're gambling on baseball games. You're gambling on football games. You're gambling on basketball games. That is when you place a bet through that app, you are gambling. And I think it's about time we let this go. I understand it was illegal at the time, and he was betting on his team back in the day. Let me, let me. This is this is something that that has been going through my mind all last night as I was going to work. Back in the day, uh, I used to work in a lot of factories. In Ohio, we have factories, so yeah, I started out as a factory worker, and the old timers. And uh, you know, and us youngers, we had a, a comedy. One thing we could, we got along with was if, if we couldn't talk about anything else, it was sports. When we came, when when any other topic came up, we probably couldn't really understand. Yeah, hey, what are these youngins talking about? And some we thought, oh, those old timers, you know, what are they talking about? When back in my day, you know, we we, we get that a lot. But when it when it came to chronomity, you know, hey, Titus Man can't speak right. But when it came to things we had in common, sports was always the key. And, and this is from the old timers. So don't take this as a big fact. Don't take this. Take this as a great this statement with a grain of salt. Because the old timers, well, you know, they didn't say, hey, Titus Man, you, you know what you're talking about when it comes to sports. And I'm like, yeah, well, yeah, I watch a lot of it. And, you know, hey, uh, that, that goes to a lot of us. We surprised those old timers from time to time, you know. Uh, but I was like, hey, you think I could place a bet on, let's say, the Packers game? And they're like, well, Titus Man, well, of course, that's not what they would call me. They'd call me by my real name because, you know, we were co-workers. Uh, but they would say, Listen, kid, you don't want to do that. And like I said, this is from the old timers. Um, to place a bet, you got to know somebody. And then you got to trust that person not to stick you in the back when you win. Because winning is the worst thing you can do when placing a bet while gambling on sports. Because the, the, the least thing that could happen to you, you lost your money and they're not going to pay you. The worst thing can happen to you, you're in the ground, kid. So, um, when when I when I talk about gambling, like yeah, I'll place a bit right right there and then on, on my app because that's what what we have now. We we we're all good at this now, and, and I understand that that that's a that's a problem. I understand it's a blimp on his career, but if we're talking straight the player. Pete Rose is the player. He belongs in the Hall of Fame. He has done so much for the game. And maybe that's because I'm an Ohioan. I know he was a Cincinnati Reds player, a Cincinnati Reds manager. But we, we need to get over the fact that, oh my God, he gambled on his team. 
because we do it all the time now. We place bets all the time. Uh, and the baseball, football, basketball. We, we need to get over the fact that Pete Rose had a gambling problem and put the man in the Hall of Fame. And it, it saddened me that it will probably happen because the man has passed. But we should have done that while he was still alive. So he would got his recognition while he was still alive. Um, rest in peace, uh, Pete Rose. We will miss you. You were one of the greats. And I, I have been on both sides of the argument. I, I understand the argument of why no one wants Pete Rose in the Hall of Fame. And I understand why that, uh, uh, you know, we want him in the Hall of Fame. And for for that, you know, you know, this is a conversation we're all going to have. Let me know in the comments section down below uh, what you, you think. What are your what's your arguments for and against? Um, don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. That's man. He's out.